Welcome, this is Prime Time News. I'm Abisha Basti. It's Cola News, Sri Lanka's number one news channel. Headlines import tax on rice reduced. Sri Lanka reports 468 COVID-19 infections. Sri Lanka joins World Bank Human Capital Project. Daily heavy rainfall accepted in the parts of the island today. Issued landslides warning. Sri Lanka and Pakistan one day international cricket match today. Detail news. Import tax on rice reduced. The special committee levy on imported samba, nadu and raw rice has been amended, the Ministry of Finance announced. Accordingly, the import tax on rice, which previously stood at 50 rupees to 60 rupees, has been reduced to 25 cents per kilogram. Sri Lanka records 468 COVID-19 infections. The Epidemiology Unit of the Health Ministry says that another 468 persons have been tested positive for the novel coronavirus. This pushes the total number of COVID-19 cases registered in the country. Sri Lanka joins World Bank Human Capital Project. The government of Sri Lanka committed to accelerate more and better investments in human capital, health education and social protection the World Bank Human Capital Project. Fairly heavy rainfall is in the parts of Ireland too. Showers and thunderstorms will occur at times in western South and in western provinces and in Gaul and Matar district, says the Department of Meteorology. Heavy showers about 75 mm can be accepted at times places in western Sabaragamua, Uwa, central and northwestern provinces and Gaul and Mathal district. Issued landslides warning. The National Building Researchers Organization has issued landslides warning for the total of eight districts, Badulla, Kagol, Gaul, Kalutara and Kandy and in Ratnapura. Sri Lanka and Pakistan won the international cricket match today. Sri Lanka and Pakistan won the international cricket match today has been postponed for tomorrow due to the bad weather. That's all today. Thank you and bye-bye.